How to add a persistent material banner to the top of your scaffold in Flutter. The banner can also include one or even multiple actions for the user. Let's start with an elevated button and if we click on this button here on the right side then we want to call the method show banner and inside of this method you can then call on your scaffold messenger the method show material banner and inside of this method you put then a material banner widget. Next to the background color of the material banner you can also supply here the main content which is normally a text widget. And you can also set here the style for this text widget by supplying the content text style. And lastly, you also need to add here mandatory some actions. Therefore, we want to create here a simple text button. And with this, if we click on this button, then we display here a material banner. And like you notice on the left side, we display then the content. And on the right side, we have this dismiss button, which we have defined over this actions property. If we now click on this dismiss button, then nothing is happening and therefore we go inside of this on press center and here you can also call on your scaffold messenger the height current material banner method. Make sure to click on hot restart and with this, if we click on this dismiss button, we hide our material banner. Alternatively, you can also add here multiple actions, therefore I define here another text button with the text set timer. And secondly, you could also include here some padding, which is some spacing around our main widgets. And with this, we have here two action buttons. And if you have at least two action buttons, then they are displayed here under our content. Next, you can also integrate here a leading icon. Therefore, you have here the leading property where I set some icon inside. And with this, we have here this icon on the left side of our content. And you could also set here the space between your icon and your content. And therefore you have here the leading padding where I set right now a space of 24 pixels. And with this, we have here 24 pixels in space between. Importantly, we can only display here one material banner at a time, which means if I try to also show here another banner by clicking on the show banner button, then this is not displayed. First of all, the previous banner needs to be dismissed before the other banner can then show up. If you want to show your important banner directly, then you also need to add here to the scaffold simply this remove current material banner method. And with this, our existing banner will be deleted if we click here on the show banner button method and the important banner will then show immediately. And by the way, if you want to get here this whole source code of this example, then you can get it with the first link in the description and with the second link you can get access to my Flutter courses where I teach you how you can become a better and more efficient developer. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel.